Hey everyone, I'm Eric Hansen and welcome to a new episode of Tracking Dirt. In this episode, we are exploring the fantastic Mojave Desert of Eastern California. And I'm super excited to show you this amazing place. So check it out. The Mojave Desert is vast, lonesome, and beautiful. It's the kind of place that has inspired cowboys and poets, and has been the visual backdrop for countless Hollywood films. So we just arrived in the California desert last night, and uh, we are now driving on a lonesome desert highway into the Mojave Desert. And we're really excited to be exploring some dunes and some canyons and uh, see what the Mojave Desert has in store for us. My adventure begins in the tiny desert town of Amboy, where I'm meeting up with Kyle and Kelly, who will be guiding me through the newly formed Mojave Trails National Monument. Man, these wildflowers are everywhere right now. I love the yellow on black, it really stands out. So what's the, what's the story with Amboy Crater? Like how did it get here? What is it? So Amboy Crater is actually a cinder cone volcano that erupted approximately 10,000 years ago. Yeah. Uh, and it created this lava field that we're hiking through right now. 27 square miles of lava. Uh, so it's a, a pretty good flow. Yeah, you can see it from miles around. Yeah. It's pretty And cool. it, it really stands out, the, uh, the black lava just looks like there's a permanent shadow out here even when there aren't any clouds on the sky. Yeah. Whew. Let's get you working up here. Get steep. I'm here in the middle of the Mojave Trails National Monument on top of Amboy Crater, and uh, just getting to explore this old volcanic flow uh, and the cone. It's pretty wild. It's otherworldly up here, and it also provides just an amazing viewpoint to see this whole basin of the desert here. It's a surreal feeling to be able to hike the rim of the ancient caldera while taking in one of the desert's more unique features. It's a good thing we're here in the spring because Amboy Crater turns into a furnace in the summer. As the sun fades and the desert cools, Kyle, Kelly, and I head to one of the gems of Mojave Trails to catch the sunset. The Cadiz sand dunes are formed as sediment is carried down the Colorado River. The sand is picked up by winds and then deposited here hundreds of miles away in the mountain ringed basin. The result is an incredibly harsh and beautiful environment. It's amazing being on the top of the Cadiz sand dunes here. There's only a couple of times in my life where I've been just truly felt like I'm in another world. And uh, here on the top of the sand dunes, nothing around but vast open desert. The colors that come out after the sun goes down below the horizon, it's mind blowing. It just feels so amazing out here. Kyle, Kelly, and I are setting off for an adventure here in Afton Canyon. We're gonna be hiking up and uh, looking for a place called Spooky Canyon. And uh, looking forward to getting into the slots and just exploring this cool place. There's like a lot of really interesting geology happening here. And uh, mostly it's just gonna be a great day in the desert. So super excited for today. So Afton Canyon uh, used to be a lake, Lake Mannix either through a, a major flooding event or an earthquake. The earthen dam broke, draining the lake over the course of several days to maybe a week or two, uh, and it, it rapidly carved out what is now Afton Canyon. Oh, this is some weird stuff in here. Oh yeah, this is uh, just a, a gentle introduction into the diversity of Afton Canyon. Oh yeah? Is there more up canyon? Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah? Oh, well, all right. Oh, wow. That's cool. 
Oh yeah, that's actually dark. I'm really excited about this part. We're getting into the narrows of the spooky Slot Canyon. And uh, I geek out about Slot Canyons, I love them. And uh, this is an entirely different style of Slot Canyon. All right guys, you win, this is a wrap. Can we keep climbing? Oh yeah, keep going. All right. This is not the end. Wow. Well, we've encountered our biggest obstacle yet. There's a large wall and uh, there are some ropes, so it does indicate that maybe there's a way up and we're gonna give it our best effort and try to get up this kind of intimidating looking part of the canyon here. Oh yeah, boys. Made it to the top. And we yeah. go. <laughs> nice job. Good climbing. I think we're nearing the end. Having climbed our way through Spooky Canyon, we find ourselves back in the blazing desert sun. From here, we ascend a little more to an overlook that provides a proper sense of scale for this magnificent place. Standing on a peak in California, looking upon a stunning landscape that's unlike anything I've ever seen before, it really drives home how incredibly diverse California is and how many different experiences there are to be had here. Although this road trip has taken me from the northern end of the state to the southern end, I know I haven't begun to scratch the surface of what this place has to offer, and I can't wait to come back. Thanks so much for following along on our adventure here in the Mojave Desert. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe to our channel here, and I hope you enjoyed Tracking Dirt. I'm Eric Hansen. See you later.